everybody it's Ramona I am coming to you with entry number 41 my goodness and this comes to us from South Carolina I'm not sure who though so let's see what we have here oh I'm loving those colors can you guys see those colors that's beautiful so that we have a belly band with a gorgeous girl stamped on it how cute is that So I have a card. Oh my gosh, there's a bunch of stuff in there. Oh, look how pretty. Hello. Look at this pretty butterfly. It's thick. It's cut out with some thick stuff. Oh my goodness. Look. Now your day, bl day bloom with happiness. It's artfully Bridget Murray. So that's Bridget Murray. And I love all the stickles that she used on the, all the um, Winka Stellas. And look at this cute little girl. See, I want to learn how to do that. I want to learn how to Copic like that. So this is a large one. I'm just going to go ahead and give you the basics right now. And I'll read the rest offline because I don't know if she wants me to or, or not. Um, let's see. She is, okay, she's Bridget Murray. She's in South Carolina. Her YouTube is Bridget Murray. She doesn't have any YouTube videos presently. She loves paper crafting and small art quilts. Oh, wow. Colors, red, pink, turquoise, and glitter. Oh, yeah, girl. Glitter, glitter, glitter. The more glitter, the better, right? So there's the cute little card that she wrote. I will read the rest of that when uh, offline. So I have this beautiful oh my gosh look how cute that is that is definitely vintage and uh tea for you so i have some tea thank you so much i really needed tea i was so down the other day with uh pneumonia oh my goodness can i just just for a second break away from this look at this butterfly Bridget, if you made this butterfly, please let me know how you did it. <gasps> Look at it. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, we need to know how to do that. That's beautiful. Okay, so we have another baggie here with all kinds of stuff. She made a beautiful. Look at this. Oh, I love these colors. I'm going to be doing a, um, a gypsy project soon and this would go with that gypsy project okay let's see what we have here let me get this open she's got some beautiful uh vintage washi closing this up that's so cute how you have that closed up okay and here we go so i have some die cuts with shirts on it super cute colors and i've got some bling here Ooh, look at this bling never seen anything like that before that's like stained glass I've got tags die cut here and this takes a long time to do guys and some owls here that takes a long time to do people don't realize how long it takes to do all that look at these beautiful colors that she used though i am so excited about this butterfly i can't even stand it okay let's see here oh wow i love how she closed that up too I mean, look at that. She just wrapped it up like just like that and it slid right out. It's a clever idea. Look at all of this. Oh, wow. So we have like simplicity patterns here. This picture here. We've got a little baggie here that has an R for my name with a vintage butterfly underneath. I've got a vintage girl here that says happy birthday. She's blinged it all out. And then we have the Singer Sewing Machine. How cool. I love everybody showing their different side of what vintage is. Crayolas. Look at that. That's really cute. Old scissors. Remember these old scissors, guys? They used to weigh a ton. An old sewing machine. Sing, singer Sewing Machines again. And all kinds of old thread. Spools of tr thread. And then she's backed it up with just newspaper like a newspaper article which is so stinking cute and then of course all of her goodies are here 
Thank you so much, girl. I appreciate all this so much, especially the cards, Bridget. I know that takes a long time to do that. Let us know if you made that or not, because that is amazing. I would love, love to try that technique. It, I don't know, guys. I would love for you to feel it. It's got a very cool feel to it. So thank you so much, Bridget. Really appreciate your entry, and um, have a good weekend. Bye-bye.